metadata, there are lots of uh, ways people describe metadata. The most general is information about information or data about data, but that's kind of abstract. Uh, so uh, you can think about a library catalog, if that helps you, where we describe information. We may describe it by its author, its title, its date, and its subject. There are many different metadata standards that have been created over the last 15, 20 years to help describe digital information, uh, primarily digital information on the web. And so some people say metadata is like cataloging for the internet, but uh, data description, describing resources beyond libraries has been around long before uh, the internet. And uh, metadata is sort of a new umbrella term to, to describe this. So we talk about a, a range of different kinds of metadata standards and vocabularies, and the question of folksonomy is one of really interesting. And uh, folksonomies are vocabularies that are created by people just through their natural activity, tagging. If you had photographs, you might tag them. The uh, area that I'm interested in is you take uh, general uh, concepts that people might come up to tag their photograph or their digital data and link them to more standard vocabularies. So you have, uh, at the low end, folksonomy. Then you have what might be called a folk taxonomy, which leads it to more, more towards standardization. And then uh, at a more sophisticated level, you have taxonomy. And those are the standard vocabularies that get uh, reviewed by uh, information uh, library scientists and discipline people. And they get uh, a standard number on them. And those are um, the standard vocabularies that come into formal metadata. But folksonomy is certainly uh, a form of metadata and an area where we've been looking.